Thank you. This is the 2013 NCAA Women's Championship presented by Capital One. We are in Lubbock, Texas, and electrifying energy filling the United Spirit Arena for the first game of our doubleheader. 15 seed Fresno State taking on two seed California. Upperclassmen leadership, a theme for both these teams. Number 25, Rosie Moult, a senior for Fresno State, making her fourth straight appearance in the NCAA Women's Championship. Interesting start for Cal. Three points aren't necessarily their specialty. Really, the Fresno State offense runs through the three. And there's one there. Rosie Moult with the answer. Rosie Moult and three. Oh, your skills are on display there. Like Jennifer Brandon got a piece of that on the block. Moult with a solid defense down low two times. Number 15. Jim Rigby drives. Again, some layups not falling from either side. Yeah, it's a little nerves, I think, opening round of the tournament. Trying to get off on the right foot. Good D by Pierre, cutting off the driving lane. Boyd with the lead pass to Moult, the kick out. Offensive rebound, Kiki Moore. Thompson starts it up again. Love the quick release of Rosie Moult. Fresno State takes the lead, 9-7. Well, again, unless you're used to playing a team like this, Kara, you have to stay on the shooters. And Cal used to sucking in on the rebounding tip because they're so good on the glass, it leaves the shooters from Fresno State wide open on the three. A lot of confidence with this Fresno State club. Little loses the Substitution on the floor for the Golden Bears. Rashawn DeGray working in the post right there. Denied by Moult. Brandon with the offensive rebound. Second chance points, a hallmark of Cal's success. But couldn't come up with any there. Like that. Jim Rigby comes down hard. job by Rosie Moult. That's a part of what great pressing teams have to do. Not give up on the play. Backside flow towards the ball. Deflection saving a layup opportunity. She's got the hot hand right now. That pass deflected straight to Moult. More on the break. Defensively. Bree Farley had the lane shut down by Brandon. And there's that trigger Rosie release, Moult third three. three of the game for Rosie Moult, the senior. Rosie Moult, second team, all Mountain West Conference and all defensive team. And so what a weapon to be able to have a post player to step out and hit the three. Great defender. Just really doing a, an excellent job this afternoon for Fresno State. Moult for three, in and out. Thompson rattles in and out on the three. Fresno State's had some decent looks, but. Scrappy play by Moult to prevent an easy Cal basket because it was another great pass on the way into the post. Moult along with fellow senior Gina First, the winningest class in Fresno State history, this group over 78% in their four years. Been to four straight NCAA tournaments. Moult, one of three Australians in the starting lineup for the Bulldogs. And Reagan Peebley tells us she's going to keep that recruiting pipeline to Australia alive moving forward. Robin Draper comes up with it. That's how Fresno State's going to get back in this game. They've got to force some turnovers. Get some easy looks and hit some threes. I think Rosie hurt you, Steven. Offensive rebound for Caldwell. She goes right back to the basket, robbed by Moult. Out to get Moult at three. Good execution, just didn't drain it. But Moult with the steal there. More Moult and Thompson going one, two, three in steals this season in the Mountain West Conference. Cal 
really locking down defensively. How did Mold see more leak to the basket? She is an outstanding player overall with post skills, perimeter skills to shoot the three, but just showed us her beautiful passing ability. Caldwell and Jennifer Brandon is wearing Fresno State down. Oh, rattles in and out to have an answer for another great move from Boyd. Molt fouled by Jim Rigby on the way to the basket. Season. She's had a career high of 13 rebounds versus Oregon State. She's just, there's nothing that she can't do on the basketball court. Boyd has four double-doubles this season.